Uh, hey there, uh, this is the first and uh, pressure key tester uh, from LabSync. Uh, it uh, it is consisted of two parts. Uh, this is the tester itself, and uh, this is the test station where we can load the test samples. Here I have loaded uh, a pouch, you can see it here. Um, by adjusting the arm, uh, we, can, uh, uh, we can change the height because the inflated pouch of it, uh, will have a bigger height, you can see. And uh, by adjusting um, these two screws, we can also adjust uh, the height um, more precisely. Uh, today I will show how to how to do the pressure decay test with the with this detector. First, let's come to the preset. Um, you can see there are four test uh, programs. Uh, the second one is the creep test. Uh, it is also called the called the pressure decay. And here I set the pre preset pressure as uh, seventy millibar. And uh, the um, preset time is 15 seconds. Uh, here, uh, also, uh, uh, there is another important uh, parameter called amplitude. And uh, it is the uh, allowable pressure decay from the pre preset pressure uh, in this uh, time. For example, if oh. the pressure decay is over 10 millibar uh, in 15 seconds, the, the pouch the pouch will be considered as a disqualified one uh, okay now, now we finish on the pre parameter setting come to the test uh, actually it is very easy to use this tester um, when we finish the parameter setting we just uh, press the button test and test the valve again you can say uh, the pressure inside the pouch did not increase. In this case, we have to adjust the flow rate. By, by turning it uh, clockwise, we can increase the flow rate. And uh, when the pressure reaches 70, it, the time will build up. Now you can see the test finished. And uh, the sample is uh, accepted. That means the, the pouch, the pouch uh, has a pressure decay over uh, 10 millibar. Okay, that's all.